Hi there, it's Polygon Experts, and in this video we have a good news for the people who have purchased the MAD Laboratory Models Pack for the Unity or want to purchase it. As we know, MAD Laboratory is created with the previous versions of the Unity which didn't support the HDRP feature. So, the default render pipelines in this asset is a standard building. But nowadays, with Unity supports the HDRP in the current versions, we have decided to add a new feature uh, to this asset so that it supports HDRP as our new release for the people who have purchased this asset before or want to purchase it from now. And in this video, I want to show you how to use this feature in the assets if you want to use it in the HDRP version. For the start, I have loaded uh, Mad Laboratory Models Pack and I am in the demo scene of the asset that uh, you had before and you can find it in the Mad Laboratory Models Pack folder and by clicking on the demo. And uh, this is the demo scene which is created with the standard render pipeline. And let's imagine you want to change it to the HDRP. For the HDRP feature, we have added two new things. One is a scene called the demo underscore HDRP which is this HDRP versions of this scene. And the other one is a folder called HDRP packages, which includes some uh, packages which supports the HDRP features such as materials, profiles, and other things like that. For changing your scene from the standard render pipeline to the HDRP, first uh, you go to the MAD Laboratory Models Pack folder and by clicking on the demo scene, demo HDRP scene, you will see your demo scene overexposed. Uh, but uh, you must not be worried about that because this overexposed scene shows us it's not ready yet for the HDRP version. The other things we must do is by going to the HDRP packages and uh, start to import all the packages one by one in our project. So we will click on the uh, packages and start to import. And after importing all the packages from the HDRP packages, uh, all the sin becomes violet, but you must not be worried about that because we will fix it. And this problem is caused because we haven't uh, added and installed the high definition RP from the Unity Package Manager. So we must go to the window and uh, by clicking on the Package Manager, And loading the packages, we will start to search for the high definition RP from the list. So here's the high definition RP, and we will start to install that. After installing the high definition RP from the Unity Package Manager, another window appears called the HD Render Pipeline Wizard that warn you that there are some features that are not ready for the HDRP yet and we must fix them all by clicking on the Fix All. And after that, another window appears that wants us to create or load HD Render Pipeline asset. We have it in our asset, so we will click on the Load one. And here we will choose the HD render pipeline asset. And as you see, all the uh, issues is fixed now, but uh, one more thing is remained default in prefab that is not fixed yet. So we will click on the fix. And uh, again, another window appears that wants us to create or load HD default scene because we have it. We will click on the load one and here we will start to search for the default scene route and load the default scene route and here it is now our scene is ready for the hdrp so let's see what we have this is our scene but it's not uh, fully created so let's go to the hdrp packages and again let's click on the hdrp default resources to import it and let's reload this scene again. So I will go to the Mad Laboratory Models Pack and click on the demo scene. And click on the demo underscore HDRP again to reload it again. And 
And this is the final result of the MAT laboratory models pack in high definition render pipeline which we have created for you guys. And uh, if you look at the scene, we have uh, created some lighting setup according to HDRP. We have changed our materials and the materials are compatible with high definition render pipeline. And uh, by saving this uh, project, now you have the MAT laboratory models pack uh, compatible to HDRP and you can use all the models in here in your other HDRP scene. You can use this demo scene and other things like that and uh, at the end feel free to contact us if you have any problems uh, and if you have any suggestions uh, by the way we have mentioned in our assets and all the comments will be welcome because they uh, they will help us to improve ourselves in the current assets and in our future assets and at last don't forget to visit our website and check our assets in there and you will have access to our assets and their information about that in our websites and you can purchase the assets by clicking on them and directly go to the unity asset store for purchase them uh, let us know your review from the assets let us know your comments let us know your suggestions and help us to improve ourselves for our current assets and for our future assets and there is nothing left to talk about in this video just to have my best wishes for all you guys have a good time good luck